Hey guys, it's Christina here, and today I thought I'd give you guys ideas of what to watch or suggestions on what to watch during the Christmas time. And these are my top 10 favorite Christmas holiday, holiday movies that I love watching during the holidays, whether it be by myself, with my friends, with my brother, with my parents, with my entire family. So let's get right into the video. So the first movie comes as no surprise because it is my all-time favorite movie to watch during the fall season in general during the fall season and that is a nightmare before Christmas if you know me I'm a horror fanatic I love horror movies more than any other genre it's like first is horror comedy sci-fi action and then romance all the way at the bottom and so this is like one of my favorite movies I love watching it I watch it like not even just fall like I watch it year-round where I really love the movie just because it's one of my favorite animated movies I'm not really a fan of animation like animated movies all that much I don't know why but this happens to be one of my favorites and it's animated the second movie is actually a very popular one amongst a lot of like teenagers and adults and that is elf I enjoy elf so much I love 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 Will Ferrell he's one of my favorite comedians besides Jim Carrey Will Ferrell is one of my favorite comedians so yeah I love elf and I think it's like hilarious and anyone can watch it honestly the next movie is actually Home Alone, the entire like series of Home Alone movies, like every single one of them. I enjoyed them so much and I love the idea of like a mischievous little boy like tricking adults. I don't know, I just think it's really funny and my brother has always been one of those kids where like I feel like if this was to happen to anyone it would happen to my brother just because my brothers always remind me of Kevin from the movie so yeah. And if you haven't watched any like Home Alone movie please watch it, it's the funniest thing ever. I like the older ones more than and the newer ones just because like I feel as though the, the newer one is not all that great. Holy Hogan, he's so funny in the movie and I just think that it's a really good movie and you should check it out. The next movie is actually Santa Claus. Obviously, I mean Christmas, Santa Claus, Santa Claus. I mean, in general, I just think the movie is so funny and I just enjoy it a lot and I think it's very interesting because it, it's kind of like the opposite of like the kid doesn't believe in Santa Claus but the adult does so I think it's like really funny and then like you have him like not believing that he turns into it and then all of a sudden he's like Santa Claus. I just think it's a really good movie and everyone should check it out. The next one is Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas which is also one of my favorite like childhood movies like growing up that was like one of my favorite movies to just watch and like enjoy as a kid just because I love Dr. Seuss and like I just think it's a really good movie and if I was to like play any movie for my family like my little cousins or like my nieces and nephews it would definitely be Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Also, the next one is actually It's a Wonderful Life. I enjoy classic movies like from like before the 1960s sometimes. Like some movies are really good, some movies are like, eh, not really a fan. But I enjoyed this one. It's actually a really good movie. And it's sometimes shows in like theaters still apparently. Like I'm looking right now and I'm like, whoa, like, that's crazy. But I just really like, if I was to watch romance movies, it would either have to be the new ones that came out or the really old vintage like 1950s 40s movies because the ones in between are not really that great and they're kind of cringy. Another good movie to watch for like Christmas time is actually A Christmas Carol. It reminds me of like human adult version of The Grinch like Ebenezer Scrooge like I just think that that like that aspect of it I love just because like I mean some people hate that like that idea of like Santa Claus but like I love the idea of like Santa Claus and then you have like his arch nemesis or the antagonist if you will of the like movie and it's just very interesting to see how their minds work and to see them like kind of turn around in the end like sometimes they turn around sometimes they don't but yeah and Jim Carrey another one of my favorite movies like this one counts as like a childhood movie but it's actually Frosty the Snowman me and my brother growing up me and my brother we would always watch like animated movies just because he was a little kid and he liked animated movies more than I did and I do <laughs> so he would love to watch like Frosty the snowman and then like if it was snowing that day he would make my dad like 
take us outside to build Frosty the Snowman. And he was like praying that it would actually happen. Another good movie is actually Miracle on 34th Street. I actually like this one because it's like, it's like kind of like a mystery, but also like a holiday movie. So I really like Miracle on 34th. Another animated movie that's, it's not really, like I said, not really a fan of animated movies, but if I was to watch animated movies, another one is The Polar Express, which is a really good movie. Like I started watching, I, I watched that movie back like when I, the movie came out when I was six. I watched it like when it first came out. I remember when it first came out and I was like, oh my God, oh my God, I really want to see this movie. It seems so cool. Like, it's like a mysterious train just appears and it's like, it's an express train. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got ideas of what to watch during the holidays with your hot cocoa by the fire because that's what I'm going to do. And I hope you guys have a great holiday. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!